going to do the same thing. This, we notice that uh, you know this thing doesn't pick up this piece of wood, right? So I'm going to put a bit of water here, okay? And I'm going to do exactly what she's doing. Now, what do you notice about the temperature of the glassware? Now, put your hand underneath. What do you notice there? It's, cold. it's getting cold. Um, what she's just done is she's made a cold pack. She's made an ice pack that you guys buy when you have aching muscles and it reaches uh, below like minus 13 degrees and it's quite endothermic. Yes, very good. There we go. So is it getting colder? Okay, let's do this. Okay, so let's pass this around. Hold it by the neck. Now let's get you to turn around and take a look at the slide here, okay? So the, um, the philosophy about this is that this is the cold pack. You know when you have a cold pack? What's the first thing that you do when you have this cold pack out of the freezer? You crack it. You crack it. So what's, the, yes, you crack it. Um, the philosophy of this is that there's, there's two chemicals there. So you are breaking the two chemicals that you have and it's absorbing heat. It's absorbing heat that end up the surrounding temperature gets cold. And that's why when you're, you're, you're holding that, the coldness is, is shown in the glassware, the outside of that glass, okay? Thank you very much, round of applause for this lady here. Okay. Now this is a, I, I always tell students that um, I don't have to uh, buy this stuff. If you were uh, in the Amazing Race or you're in Survivor, I'm the best contestant that you can uh, hire because I can make my own stuff uh, from scratch. I don't have to buy this stuff. I do this in my own laboratory. Okay. Now, oh, if this works, um, Kayla, can you come back here? Because it absorbs so much energy, the outside surrounding, like about here, gets cold. It should mean that these, the water that I put down there has frozen. So this works. I like it to pick up the glass by the neck. There you go. Okay? And let's get you to pass that along to everyone. And hopefully it doesn't break. Yeah? Shouldn't. If you be careful with it. And that's how endothermic it is. Thanks. Okay. All right, we're going to do uh, an exothermic reaction before uh, our next concept. So the next person to help us out, Zora. Right here. Excellent. Okay, Zora. What I have here is uh, here's a scoop up. Okay. Now, Sora, what I have here is uh, a chemical called sodium acetate. Uh, sodium acetate, okay? And what I'd like you to do is um, uh, I'll take the lid off, and you're going to take a little speck, just a really tiny amount. This is a great example of an exo, uh, endothermic, sorry, an exothermic reaction. I have, Sora, a magic Harry Potter solution. Very sensitive. Magic Harry Potter. Okay. Yes, yes. Now, what's in here is a saturated solution of sodium acetate. And what we're going to do is, um, I'll touch it against your, your hand here, but is it at room temperature? Yep. Okay. So, I'd like you to observe compared to what Kayla demonstrated for you. Observe what will happen when she puts a bit of that speck in there. Do you need more? Nope. Okay. And this is now an example of an exothermic reaction because touch the bottom of it. What do you notice about the It's hot. It's hot. Okay. This is an example. <laughs> This is an example of a hot pack. Pass that around. Okay? 
Okay, thank you, sir. Now, the hot tap, how many of you um, have seen these these days when you're camping? These hand warmers. Have you seen these things before? Okay. How many of you have this in your homes? Have you seen this? Now, what you, you can buy this at trade shows. You can buy this at camping stores like Sports Check and Camp Outfitters and stuff. But when you buy this, this is the when it's hardened, just like that. So the ingredients is sodium acetate. You will often find a, a coin in there, and it's saturated with that solution. And what you would do is, it's not actually like a coin or anything of value or money. You crack the coin, and it causes a, 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 the, the activation of that thing to harden, just like how she put that little speck in there. And this is what happens. It reaches to like that degrees. People use that for camping to warm their toes when they're sleeping. And uh, all you have to do is put this in hot water, and it will uh, dissolve, and then you can reuse it again. And we've always used that demo for the last few years. We never had to replenish it. We just uh, crystallize it, dissolve it, crystallize it, dissolve it, and that's the hot pack, guys. Okay? And so I am the best contestant to make cold pack and hot pack for you guys. Do you guys like that demo? Yeah. Okay, round applause. Thanks very much. Okay. Let's go back to our desk.